Hey, what's up, guys? It's uh, me, Ants Canada, and I'm here at uh, the workshop in the warehouse um, where all your nests are made. And I'm here, it's 2.30 in the morning on a Saturday night. Um, why am I here? Because we're all dedicated here at Ants Canada um, to provide you your nests, you know, and you know, the support for the store has been wonderful. And so all of us are really working around the clock um, to make sure you guys get your um, formicaria and your ants keeping products um, on time. And, you know, we don't mind being here on a Saturday night. It's fun. I decided to take a break um, so I could create this awesome Wicked video of a new and exciting product that the Ants Canada store is launching. So, these are called Micro Habitat Outworlds. Ants Canada. It kind of just, the, the title itself um, explains what it is. It's pretty much just a small outworld um, and uh, it's, it's geared mostly for um, beginning colonies, you know, and now that it's uh, spring and, you know, we're getting into anting season, Nantics are eclosing um, from queens that are caught, were caught last year, and queens that are being caught this year are producing brood now. So, um, we are releasing just on time for all of that. Uh, these Ants Canada Micro Habitat Outworlds. And uh, so the premise is pretty much like the other outworlds. The uh, ground layer here is completely solid and the ants cannot burrow in it. Um, but it is very naturalistically designed. Uh, we've got like sticks and twigs, um, a sand layer as well. <clears throat> and um, of course the ground layer is water absorbent so um, you can moisten that when needed um, and it's a uh, half moon front it bubbles out so it's it, it makes viewing very 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 good um, now so the way it works is you simply place Vaseline just on the tip here you don't have to smother it you know there just on the tip um, and as well on the cover, not all over the cover, but uh, just, you know, along the sides here. That's it. That's all you need to cover. And, um, and if you want, you can even cover these little holes here. <clears throat> it, and they're very small. I mean, if you have Campanotis, they pro it probably can contain the ants even without the Vaseline. Um, but the cover is very cool. Um, it's one of those slide snap-in covers, so you basically snap and then pull it open, like so. Um, so you never really ever have to remove the cover. Um, and it snaps securely in place onto the microhabitat outworld, like that. Oops, there it goes. Um, and you know, you can open this as needed, close it, lock it. You know, snaps into place and clean it and all of that um, so and how does it attach to the nest basically there are two holes here you see them and they fit perfectly into our um, half inch tubing um, so that fits into the holes um, and then fits onto the back of your nest and uh, it makes wonderful viewing, you know, it's really, really nice um, to just see your ants in a kind of natural setting. Um, and it's very small, you know, nice and portable, which I think is fantastic. There is room, see, there's lots of room there. You can place a test tube uh, for water. Um, and another thing you can do is, if you don't even have a formicarium, if your young colony is starting off in a test tube, you can just block these off 
these little holes here with cotton and then just place the entire test tube inside the microhabitat outworld. It can be kind of just a, you know, entire, I guess, habitat for them. Another useful way in which the microhabitat outworlds can be used is by using them as an open venue to introduce your young and growing test tube colonies to a proper formicarium. Simply connect the formicarium to the microhabitat outworld and place the test tube with the ants into the microhabitat outworld, as seen in this photo of a young Lasius alienus colony being introduced to a small beige habitat nest. The arrangement allows the ants to move in on their own time. They will make use of the outworld and forage until they eventually discover the formicarium you have set up for them and finally decide to move in. Oh, and now that we're talking about connections, we should also mention the microhabitat outworlds of course can be connected to each other, so you can have as broad a network of microhabitat units as you like. Um, and so yeah, this is an exciting great product, um, of course these are the field and forest um, and we also have the desert and oasis for those of you who are rearing desert species oh and again if you aren't raising desert species but you still would like to get a desert and oasis outworld by all means follow your whim um, and uh, so yeah really kind of neat Another new all original Ants Canada product coming your way. Be sure to visit the store and check it out and uh, to check out all the amazing and cool ant goodies that we have to offer for um, serious ant keepers like ourselves. Until next time, this is Ants Canada signing out on behalf of the Ants Canada Ant Store team. Thank you so much and uh, please feel free to subscribe to our videos. Thank you.